Hi, thank you for joining us at Mala Collective, where our goal is to educate you on mindfulness, meditation, and malas. My name is Britt Buntane, and in this video series, I'm gonna introduce you to meditation. So the first thing that you wanna do uh, when you're starting a meditation practice is get a good comfortable seat. I'm comfortable sitting uh, up on a cushion with my feet in what's called Burmese style, where one foot is in front of the other. Instead of ankles crossed, your heels just sort of line up in front of each other. And I have uh, a flexibility in my hips that allows my knees to rest on the ground. But if that's not the case for you, then you're able to take a blanket, a bolster, a pillow, whatever it is, place it up and underneath your legs and however you need. The goal really is not to be uh, looking like anyone else that you've seen practice meditation, but to find a way that supports your own body. If your knees are lifted quite a ways up off of the ground, even with the supports, it is helpful to find another place of support or uh, bolster or blanket, any sort of cushion to elevate your hips. Ideally, you have a forward rotation through your pelvis, so that helps by sitting upright. And what that does, it just reduces any rounding that'll occur within your low back, which will just create, um, likely create uh, pain or tension through your spine. Once you've found a comfortable seat, then you're able to relax into your breath and continue to focus on whatever your meditation is, your mantra, or simply just breath. If sitting cross-legged is not an option for you because there's any tension or aggravation within your knees or anything else going on in your hips that makes this uncomfortable to start with, then you can sit up on bolster, sort of saddle style. What you'll do is take a bolster or again pillows, blankets, whatever you have at home and you can stack them one or two depending on the height that you need and sit up on them and this way there's no tension on the back of your feet, the minimal tension through your knees then you'll just be able to sit comfortably for the length of time that you choose to meditate. And From here you just place your palms either face down or face up and close your eyes and relax. I prefer to sit in Burmese style, so I'll continue the meditation video from that place. So another thing that I forgot to mention is uh, having something to sit up on. So even though you have your cushion, you may have a blanket or something, you kind of create a throne for yourself. And this just allows your, uh, your legs to rest on something soft, especially if it's your knees that are on the ground. And when you sit up on your cushion or your bolster, you'll likely, even though there, there's a lot of space there, you'll likely wanna sit quite close towards the edge of it, so you're almost uh, falling off and slightly forward, and that'll help you get that forward rotation or tilt through your pelvis that I mentioned earlier that is supportive for your hips and your low back. So once you've found your comfortable seat, you just close your eyes, place your palms either face down or face up onto your legs. Take a deep breath in. and just shift your awareness into your spine and notice the natural position of your shoulders and the way that you lean. So just get a sense of leaning forwards and then slightly rock your weight back. And a lot of us have a tendency to lean forwards generally, so rocking the weight back may feel a little uncomfortable or just weird. But you wanna get a sense that your spine can lift upright right out of your pelvis and continue to lengthen all the way to the back of your neck. Relax your shoulders and your exhale and let your jaw be soft. And continue to let your breathing just be natural and following the inhales and the exhales. And you can slightly tuck your chin down towards your chest just so that you get a sense of lengthening up through the back of your neck. And if that creates any tension in your shoulders, actively relax and shift back into your breath. Thank you for joining us in this video today. I hope it was helpful. You can visit our YouTube channel on our website to find more videos on meditation, mindfulness, and how to use your malas. Thank you.